We've seen that one before. And that's that beautiful martial arts technique that he right. has. Oh, and the beautiful right hand. Big shot into the round. Wow, saved by the bell. Wow, Chris is badly hurt. And that's very intelligent of Chris Liebman, especially when, when you consider how tough Liebman is. I mean, he has proven time and time again he is a warrior inside that octagon. He looks very comfortable in there. Ron looks very relaxed. Oh, and look at that. Right as I said that, you're right. Tags him with a clean right hand. A lot of time. Two minutes on the clock here on the round. And let's see if Stallings can survive here on the ground. Uriah's tagging him with shots. Uriah is a finisher. Gotta look out for that up kick. He's yeah. gonna make him stand up. Big Stallings shot left eye is a mess. Time. His left eye is a mess, Mike. Wow. And that's from one punch. That's nasty. Stop. Stop. Looks like they're gonna check huh. it, Joe. It's over. The doctor has stopped the fight. Uriah Hall just may very be, may very well be the fastest middleweight in the UFC, John. The way that he moves like a phantomweight, gets that top position. Somebody's mouthpiece popped out. A miserable position to be in if you're playing from your guard here. Uriah landing some big shot. Ben Boshe is hurt. And that'll do it. Uriah Hall stopping the show early once again. See how long it takes for. Oh, him. right in the face. And now a fine knee. Uriah Hall is going to defeat Musasi. He's got him rocked. A spinning attack to the face of Gegar Musasi. Looked like maybe the referee had made contact with Hall. That will do it. Uriah Hall has done it. He comes to Japan and stuns Gegard Musasi. Unbelievable. You stand up with Uriah Hall, and he will make you pay. Hall tried to land an uppercut while backing up. Looked like he just missed there. Oh, oh he missed you with right that hand. One. Uriah Hall knocks down Chotko. Chotko in a world of trouble. Is a threat. Uriah Prime Time Hall. Do you believe it? And that's the type of punch that you always have to watch out for when you're fighting Uriah Hall. At any moment, he can put you out. Any moment. I mean, this is just such an opportunity for Bevon to come in here against a top 15 fighter like Uriah Hall in his UFC debut. And in, in my opinion, at least so far, he's put on a show. It's really excellent to see the kind of quality in these young contenders. Yeah, man. I mean, guys are coming in. Oh! There it was! That's all he ever needs! Oh! That's all he ever needs! And he knows it. He's always looking for that one punch knockout. And he got it. Oh my goodness! And he got it. Right when I just got done saying how good Bevon's looking, Uriah Hall closed the show with one shot.